All right, back on the road. We'll come on. Celine, I'm going to go now, but I'll be in touch. I'm a far too. Okay. Miss Collingham. Yes, sir. Give me a minute of your time, please. Okay. I'm not prying, but I just want to know what were you and my brother discussing earlier before I came in? Sir, I don't think I'm comfortable with you asking me that question. Does it mean everything I discuss in the office is public knowledge? No, no. Um, I'm sorry if I offended you. That was not my intention. It's just that I know my brother can be a little bit much sometime and a little bit forceful in his approach, so that's why I was asking. No, he wasn't. He was actually nice. Hmm. Nice. That's nice to hear. Well, as I said, I am sorry for being inquisitive. My apologies. That's okay. No harm done. Good to know. I feel much better. And again, I am sorry. Alright? Um, sir. Marcus, it's fine. I don't like the formalities most of the time, alright? So Marcus is fine. We were talking about housing developments and he was giving me some interesting insights. I do not have a passion for that. Okay. I see. So, maybe you'll be leaving me soon to go into development? Leaving you? The, the universal you, not me. The office, of course. That's what I meant. Not anytime soon. Okay. But if you do, just give me enough time to find a replacement. Ouch! A replacement? No, I feel like an object. <sighs> Again, that was not my intention. I just don't want to be left hanging in case you decide to pursue your dreams, that's all. Listen, Marcos. I have no intentions to leave. I'm comfortable here. Are you sure? Yes, I am. What can I do to prove it? It's interesting that you should ask me that question. I'd like for you to do a research for me. You think you're up to it? Sure. On what? What? And who? Look up the name David Mullins for me. He runs a shadow agency that has some people he calls sleepers. They operate inside and outside of the corporate area. See what you can find for me. Well, that sounds like it's uh, above my pay grade. That sounds like a work for some undercover Detective, yeah. You may be right. So here what? I'm gonna give you something that's more up your street. I'm going to ask you to work on a petition for me. I want to get the members of parliament and the oppositions to sign and vote on shutting down Mullins agency with those shady people and hoodlums that operate under his name. Okay, sir. I'll get right on it. 